Hey, what's up everybody? Today I'm going to show you how to test a magnetron. So first things first, put your meter on continuity. Okay, from your meter, uh, what I want you to check first, is I want you to check between the two terminals, okay? It should beep. Every single one of these beeps. Okay, so first cross, you test your terminals, okay? Should beep. Next thing, you take one terminal and then you test it to the chassis of the mag. Switch. Okay, no beep. So that tests perfectly. Okay, now we're gonna go over here. Same test. That tests okay too. So you see, I got three magnetrons that all pass. Now the next thing that you wanna do is you wanna check on ohms, okay? So same test, go across the F and the FA. Should have a reading between 0, 0.0 and 0 0.1. That indicates a good magnetron, okay? This is a brand new magnetron right here, okay? This is not. So we're gonna test it. Goes from 0.1, right? Now let's test this one right here. Goes zero. 0 0.1, 0, 0.0. All right, so see, we got three magnetrons here. What I want you to really look at is the damage on the antenna of the mag. See that damage? This magnetron actually passed, right? But see the damage? It, it's definitely a failure, okay? So you look at this magnetron also, see the damage? This is definitely another failure. But how come they passed? Well, it doesn't always mean that it passes, so it means that it's a good mag. You gotta pull them and you gotta look and you gotta test them. And you gotta look for damage around the antenna, on the magnets, you know, any kind of damage that you see, discoloration, anything. That's what you're looking for. And you're trying to look at the antenna itself. It's hard to see on this one, but you can see the antenna. Looks pretty bad. So this one in my hand is damaged from arcing. I mean, they're both damaged from arcing. So yeah, anyways, that's how you test a uh, microwave magnetron. It's a passer. Good luck, everybody.